This is the devotion for the month of July, and it is titled The Way of a Fool. It is based on Proverbs chapter 12 and verse 15. The way of a fool is right in his own eyes, but a wise man listens to advice. Nobody likes to admit they are wrong. However, there are occasions we each make bad decisions. It's a choice we regret making because we have to live with the consequences. There is no one that is immune from this. Even God regretted a decision he previously made. Before he destroyed the world by flood, Genesis chapter 6 and verse 6 states, The Lord regretted that he had made man on the earth. Yes, some decisions we make can lead to our sorrow. Since we know this to be a fact, what should we do before making important decisions? A fool goes with his instincts and believes he is right. However, a wise man will seek sage advice. In 1 Kings chapter 12 and verse 6, we read about King Solomon's son, Rehoboam. He was afforded the opportunity to unite Israel and Judah. All Israel asked him to do was to be nice. Rehoboam went to the older men who had counseled his father. They advised him to be good to the people, and in turn they would serve him forever. Rehoboam did not like what they had to say, so he asked the younger men whom he had grown up with. They told him to treat the people more harshly than his father. That was the advice Rehoboam wanted because he acted upon that advice. He was at war all the days of his life. Many times, people act like Rehoboam in regards to their religious practice. They already have an idea what they want to do. During the course of their life, they will come across scripture that contradicts what they want to believe. Do they seek out God's counsel and make necessary changes in their lives? The wise do, but the fool travels onward. 2 Timothy chapter 4 and verse 3 through 4 states, For the time is coming when people will not endure sound teaching, but having itching ears, they will accumulate for themselves teachers to suit their own passions, and will turn away from listening to the truth and wander off into myths. How about yourself? Are you the wise man? are the fool. Our loving Heavenly Father, Father, we pray we will act like wise men and listen to your teachings. Lord, you alone can save us from our sins. Help us, Father, to reach out to you and listen. Your wisdom far surpasses anything we can imagine. You are everlasting. You have seen all the ways of man throughout the times. Help us, Lord, to learn from you and to apply your teachings in our lives. It is in the name of Jesus we pray. Amen.